In Cinema 4D Release 20, Maxon introduced Fields, a new system for controlling the way effectors influence MoGraph cloners, and took it a step further by allowing a host of other applications outside of MoGraph. In this series, we will take a deep dive into this exciting new technology and demystify everything related to the new field system. Amongst other things, I will explain what fields are, how they work, how to create them, combine and mix them, what parameters are associated to them, and also see what other not-so-obvious things they can do for us. To follow along comfortably, it will be helpful if you had some basic understanding of Cinema 4D in general and some knowledge of how MoGraph works. If you don't possess any of the aforementioned talents, still stay with us, but alas, it may be slightly more challenging. Nevertheless, I suggest you accept the challenge, as we will leave no clone unturned, no spline untwined, and no particles lying around. Welcome to Demystifying Fields in Cinema 4D.